Hello everyone, this is CypherDeck, and today we're back in EverQuest Project 1999 on Drachmir. He is now level 49, and I am working on my epic. So I'm about to hand the totem into uh, the Seeker, who spawns the Prismatic Priest. The only way you can really do this mob is to either move him back and forth down the hole... Uh, or you'd move him up and down a set of steps that's also close by. We decided to go with the hole. Before I talk about the quest, where we're at, what happens next, or anything along those lines, I have to say thank you to XLTX, Roguish, and also uh, Roid. Those, those three made this part happen. If I didn't have them, then it would have not gotten done for maybe a few days just because um xltx gets people <laughs> gets people to do things and um i he helped me with this i helped him with trunt and um i've been i've been trying to trying to stay grouped with uh with him as much as i can because he gets me experience <laughs> um so anyway how we got to this point so a long time ago whenever i was 30 there i did a video uh where i was camping grim blocks in soul a once i got grim blocks we uh i waited because i didn't know what level i had to be for natasha to actually take the hand in or actually um the guy that you hand in the burgle crown before you would actually be able to get the coral piece so i'm 49 and i'm like i gotta i gotta get this started because i'm about to hit 50 and i want to try to get get my epic as soon as i can so i go ahead and i i get help go and kill lord burgle and uh xl comes out and he helped me do the uh the hand in so that i could uh get the coral that natasha ends up giving you take that out to um timorous deep you give the coral to o i think it's omat or ozmat and he gives you a totem and that's where we're we're at we hand that totem into the seeker seeker spawns the prismatic priest you get the bloodied robe from the prismatic priest and then you go on to uh, turn the robe in to Ozmet, and then also turn in the Grimblock's ring at the same time to Natasha, who is now not in Lake Wraith, but she is in Timorous Deep. So you hand those in, and you get your first orb, and then you also get a second coral. That coral... You turn in and burning the woods. That's going to spawn Ixplat. Kill Ixplat. Then you also need to do the Chardock Royals. And after you've done all of that, the last thing you have to do is do Ragefire. And you're done with your epic. So, hopefully today uh, I will be able to get a Chardock Raid going. We'll have to just see how that goes. But um, Ixplat might be done today, which is amazing. So... The way the Prismatic Priest works is you have to move him up and down the hall. He heals. You need to push him the, when you get him down to around 40%. And you got to push him the whole time. Uh, we got to a bottleneck, I think. And we didn't turn him when we should have. So he complete healed. That's no problem. It wasn't that hard of a fight. So we ended up going ahead and um, and getting him uh, just down. It just took a little bit longer than we normally would have. And I gotta say, the the <laughs> we had him down pretty fast the first time before he did complete heal. So it, it really this is uh, only about a five minute fight with four people. Just think about if you have a, a raid force, that could be done even faster, maybe in two minutes, if you get the the right pushing. Um, so yeah, very, very uh, fun quest. I've enjoyed it so far, and um, here, uh, once we get done with this, I actually show you all the turn-ins. 
I um, I gotta say, uh, with, throughout the last few days, specifically, I've helped with um, th three epics, I believe, and in turn, I've had help from those people that I've helped get my epic pieces uh, taken care of, and that is that's what being in a guild is all about. You help people, people help you. And, uh, and that's, that's what I am absolutely enjoying about being in this guild. Now, I, I want, I want in-game raid content, but I'm not really worried about that. I'm only level 49 right now, but, um, we're getting to that point where I should, at some point in the near future, late future, it doesn't really matter how long it takes, but I should be get, uh, get to a point where I'm getting... Halls of Testing Armor, uh, getting um, my Epic, of course, and uh, getting other upgrades. So, definitely excited about playing this character and really, really ready to, to get to, to the end of, uh, of this, this quest, specifically. But anyway, guys, hopefully you enjoyed. This is Cypher Deck. Peace out.